I'm ready for this one, man. Alate has been doing a lot of talking. Not saying it's a bad thing, but he's been building up this fight. I mean, he knows how to cut a promo. And Nea, <laughs> he's he's dangerous in his own regard, man. I mean, both these guys, both these guys are dangerous, dangerous fighters. I mean, listen, Alate is much better on the outside, I believe. When he gets behind his jab, he could snap guys' heads back with it. He's very dangerous from range. So it's going to be whether or not I feel personally for this fight, if Anea can kind of just dictate the pace of the fight early, and even if so, can he get Alate Denard out of there? Because Alate is a guy that, as as the fight goes on, he just settles in and he can he can pick you apart if you're not careful. I also talked to him <laughs> yesterday amongst other fighters, and he said, I just feel like I'm him. I just feel like I can do whatever I want in there. And he said, I, I, I don't think he's been working as hard as I have, and I'm going to show that tomorrow. And he said, watch out for the black assassin. Yeah, but were, were these the two fighters that were getting into a little bit during uh, the weigh-ins yesterday? Uh, I don't believe so. I think they had a pretty civil weigh-in. But, I mean, he, he is infectious with his energy. I mean, one of the most positive guys you will ever meet, a guy that's very focused on his goals, and uh, I, I just... A, to me, a future champion. He's fantastic. I, I need to figure out, find, go to the red corner room and go to the red corner locker room and find out what her song is. Yeah. Um, now to the red corner, Via Adviage. Oh, it's Ania Adviage. Alte's opponent, Ania Adviage, coming to the cage now. You see Alate waiting in there. And listen, Ania's, Ania has great pressure off the bat, man. He's one of these guys where if you're not careful, he can get you out of there early. Just I'm fantastic pressure. And you can see he has a physique for it, too. Wasting no time getting to the cage. Yep, yeah, he's another one of these guys. He's not for the antics. He likes to get in there. He likes to fight. All that other stuff is extra to him. Get some, I guess, <laughs> people going in the wrong direction here. Alrighty, so a little bit of tension, but good tension pre-fight. Let's throw it up to Steve. Ladies and gentlemen, this next kickboxing bout is scheduled for three two-minute rounds. The referee in charge of the action, J.P. Zuniga. First introducing and fighting out of the blue corner, he stands at six foot even, weighing in at 155 pounds. Under Culture Fight Club, and fighting out of Jersey City, Jersey. Alate, the black assassin, Dinar. And his opponent standing and fighting at the red corner. He stands at six foot even, weighing at 156 pounds. Under underdog MMA, I weigh of Albania. And he is the professional Albania. This fight's going to be interesting as it progresses to see which guy kind of gains more dominance. Also, just a fun fact, I did tell Alate that if he managed to pull off the W, I would have him on my podcast, him and Matt. So we got to see if he's... Uh, <laughs> He's going to get a spot. We start out here. Alate doing a good job, not really getting too antsy. Right? And also, Anaya is a little bit more uh, kind of measured when he usually starts. Except in, in, in little uh, little exchanges like that where he kind of he tends to get a little bit frenetic. But Alate is just staying, staying uh, composed, staying true to his game plan. Alate actually told me yesterday he's looking to attack the legs of Anea and, and make him lose some steam. Because he says, everyone knows me for my boxing, but I, I, I got more to my game than that. Nice leg, or excuse me, nice body kick from Anea. You watch him, one guy lands a punch, the other guy kind of shrugs it off. It's like, yeah, I got you. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is going to be the pace that they fight at. I mean, these guys, these guys are both savages. And I should also let it be known that I will be going. This will be my first post-fight interview uh, <laughs> job of the night after this. Very nice. Oh, nice. He's got him. Oh, he's got him oh, hurt. Oh, oh. Came Is across, that, yeah, oh, came that across the cage, yeah, yeah with yeah. a like a real big roundhouse right to the nuts. Yeah, it's tough. But you see Alate game to fly across the cage there and try to take him out. So it really seems to be who can kind of stay composed and enact their will to the point where one guy gets injured and the other one can kind of just swarm him. We've seen that from both guys. This is a very equal stylistic matchup. And Anaya is also kind of using that more tie. Oh my God, 
as Alate eats a head kick there. And he is starting to snap with that with that Muay Thai uh, discipline there. I did not have a chance to talk to Inea pre-fight, but it seems like what he's trying to go for is perhaps a much more uh, reduced and kind of passive approach from his last fights. And it's serving him well, honestly, because he has power in spades early. I just think in his past fights, he's tended to kind of gas himself out. So right now, he's doing a great job of conserving energy towards the end of the first round here. Yeah, less than 10 seconds to go. Both fighters are still looking good, still looking crisp. Yeah, I don't know. Again, uh, I'm not sure who you give that one to. Got to be honest. I think Alate got a little bit wild there. He's got to stick to the plan. Uh, I, again, this is just the plan that he gave me. Stick to the legs and kind of chop him down. But Anea's coming forward, man. So interesting round one. You see behind us a largely Albanian crowd. Yeah, you know, uh, Ricky is from Albania, Lorena is from Albania. You know, they have such an inspiring story. They, they left when Albania was being invaded and they came to the, to the U.S. with not much to their name and really have just earned and built everything that everything we're seeing here tonight, that's for sure. And, and you can see it's just a, uh, this is a shining example of their hard work that we get to be at this point right here with a great night of fights. All right, beginning of round two here. Any differences you think they would come out with? No, it looks like they're coming out in the same kind of measure, but night, landing that leg kick. God, those leg kicks just yeah. hurt. Oh. And it's actually Anea who's been finding more success with the leg kicks, which is interesting. I think Alate might be looking for the, the fight winning shot. He did say he has a lot to prove, so he could just be looking for a finish. I mean, usually his bread and butter is kind of grinding guys down, using that jab that you see there, and just being technical, staying on the outside. But Alte's also pushing forward more this fight, which is very interesting to see. Usually he's happy to kind of not play possum, but be on the back foot and, and let guys come to him. He's doing a good job, though. Good defense. Nice leg, or nice body kick, excuse me. As they clinch up right above us here. Spit, uh, spitting uh, and saliva and, and sweat flying everywhere here. Yeah, I've definitely left uh, this position here in the commentated seat at yeah. the end of the night with a little bit of blood, a little bit of spit on me. You're not having fun if that's not the case. We get like the best seats in the house right here, man. Ah, these seats are the best. Man, not really covering up his kicks with anything. No, I'm just threw that out there. Kind of throwing them. Alte, nice little feint into the combination there. He fights very good downhill, I must say. For a guy that usually plays the back foot role, he is very good at kind of unleashing combos. And that, that body kick from Inea has been finding his home repeatedly over the course of this fight. And you, you start to see Alate, he's kind of breathing a little bit heavier. Yeah, and he's definitely keeping that right hand down to keep that right elbow protecting those those ribs. Right. That's protected. Nea firing off combinations here. Isaiah. Oh, back and above Isaiah. all the way across Alate. the cage. Yeah, Alate fires back. And that's, listen, that's who Alate is, man. He's going to give, it, you, you really, if you're mounting offense against him, he's going to come right back at you and say, listen, that's all you got. We're going to push you back against the other side of the cage. Now I'm going to start firing. I don't, I don't know, man. I don't know who has this. No, I can't. At this point, um, I think both rounds one and two really are up in the air. I tell you, the judges, not at, le at least these days, you know, really they have good schools to go to to learn how to score the MMA fights. Um, because they have uh, or the kickboxing and everything we have going on. They have a lot in their hands right now because I don't know who's ahead. Yeah, I, I, yeah. I, and to, to be a judge, man, that, that's got to be a stressful, stressful job. It's like a ref in the NFL, you know. If you do your job, nobody thinks about you, and if you get it wrong, everyone, uh, everyone, <laughs> dog piles on you. So a very thankless job, but a very thankful job for these fighters. We get into round three here. Alta just has that supreme focus in his eye. 
You can see that dog in him. And I would say he's been kind of, I mean, for, for the limited clinching they've been doing, he's been controlling it pretty well. But the it looks like the stronger fighter. Nice attempt at a leg kick. I think it grazed in there a little bit. Nice jab downstairs. Oh, nice head movement. And this, this third round might decide the fight. Yeah, I think he's got to just be careful that he doesn't allow himself in that clinch to keep his head exposed. That opens him up to all types of strikes. He's doing a good job up top, making sure he stays safe. Nice leg kick, nice body kick. Switch body kick, nice jab from Alate. Nice kick from Anea, but Alate's pushing him forward, getting him against the fence, probably graying him down. Both fighters still staying very composed, though. Yeah, you gotta you gotta respect it. There's that body kick again. Yep, his body kick has been money. I'd say up top of the boxing, Alate is stayed true to his word. I mean, he is, for my money, I guess the the superior boxer in there as he snaps back in his head with a uh, with a cross. And I, f I forgot that Anea is Albanian, so they're gonna be a, there's gonna be a large contingency behind us. Oh, absolutely. They got the flags, they got everything. Nice, oof, snaps his head back with that jab. That's gonna, that might be a, a pivotal moment in this fight. Yeah, and I like how he really steps in on that jab too. Really oh, puts yeah. his weight behind it. Puts his weight ooh, behind snaps it. snaps his head back again. Dude, this, this last 15 seconds might have won Alate this fight. Cause he's, he's pushing the pace, man. And he's snapping Anea's head back as we get to the end of the third here. Very interesting fight. Alate, of course, is always all class, same as Enema. Enema, excuse me. Interesting one. We'll have Steve in the cage in a second to tell us who got it. But until then, your unofficial prediction, Mickey? My unofficial prediction for that fight is I'm gonna say that I'm gonna give it to Enema. You think so? I think so. Really? Um, I, don't, I don't know. You know, actually, I really don't know either. I'm getting lost in my music over here. Yeah, you're good. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to throw you off your game there. <laughs> but I tell you what, it was a great fight. And it definitely the two fighters ha had their moments each throughout the fight. But it really was uh, Alate at the end there really, really snapping back and en 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 Anaya's head with right. those jabs. Pulling away with it late. As we're going to go to Steve in the cage in a second here. He's getting himself ready. Big, big hometown support as both fighters embrace. Beautiful show, respect. Love it. Let's go to Steve in the cage. Well, ladies and gentlemen, please give it up for your winner by way of split decision and fighting out of the blue corner. Alate, the Black Assassin, Dino. All righty, so I'm going to go fly over and interview Alate. I will be right back as I have interview <laughs> <laughs> duties the rest of the night as there well as go. joint commentation. Do your thing, Commentary, brother. excuse me. So keep the people 